Okay, hi to everyone. Uh, here is my old fuel rail from the video when I was replacing it. And that's the original one. And it was leaking right here. Like at this point there was a small leak. But overall I spoke with the mechanic and what I can tell about these fuel rails. At the first, when you buy it, you see this kind of uh, rusty-ish stuff, but actually it's not the rust. This is the material used to connect these two pieces. It's not the rust. Because if you're gonna search for it, you're gonna see that each of them has on these uh, ends this uh, copper color and the mechanic confirm it's not the rust okay the second thing uh, is just overview so I unscrew the sensor because I wanted to see what's in there okay here is the how the sensor looks like inside Here is the, how the fuel rail looks from this side and this is a place where you connect your fuel injectors so as you can see there is an old uh, gasket a few of them was stuck in there I'm kind of put it in there maybe if I'll need it for the future but I don't think so so this uh, fuel rail is uh, that I just wanted to show you how it looks so you probably will have some answered questions so now I want to cut it out to see its thickness probably gonna cut closer to this area to see any like welding from inside if it's gonna be possible okay took me good 10 minutes that's what inside uh, look how thick is it it's probably I would say three and a half millimeters right there you can see the orifice it's right there also see the orifice and that's how it's looks inside okay let's take a look at the connector so you see the small hole so see right there there is a hole and also this is pretty thick and this part this cap I believe is also was uh, welded in Yeah, looking at this construction, you can hardly say that it was not the one piece originally. But anyway, you see this part is different from the tube. And it's connected to the uh, brazing or I don't know how to call this process. Here's how the gasket looks like. Yeah, but this is uh, how it was. So what I can tell, don't afraid this uh, uh, copper colorish spots. It cannot rust through the fuel rail because it's really thick pipe 
okay if you found this video interesting or helpful please give it a like